now uh, let us look at the pre in the previous question let us look at the previous question in a different manner so if we have for example n variables this is a variable v1 variable v2 variable v3 up to so on variable vn if there are n variables for these n variables 2 raised to power n different combinations are possible why because this variable can assume two values either it can assume 0 or it can assume 1 this can assume two values 0 or 1 it can assume two values 0 or 1 it can assume two values 0 or 1 for every variable we have two choices we have two choices we have two choices we have two choices so how many choices we have 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 that is equal to 2 raised to power n choices or you can say 2 raised to power n different combinations in the same way in the same way if we look at how many functions are possible if we look at how many functions are possible then for all these different combinations for every combination of function we can assume two values either 0 or 1 for every combination we have two values we have two values we have two values for 2 raised power, uh, two raised, two raised power n combination we have two values so how many switching functions are possible 2 raised to power 2 raised to power n switching functions are possible we have already discussed in the previous video okay now let me modify the previous question let me modify the previous question if i say uh, let us make it easier in the first case and then we'll make it a little bit uh, harder okay assume if the question is like this if we have three variables if we have three variables and in a function in a function there are exactly there are exactly three min terms there are exactly three min terms then how many such functions are possible then how many how many such functions are possible then how many such functions are possible so how many such functions are possible that, that means is tarah ke kitne functions yahan par banenge okay so for this let us assume uh, we have three variables uh, we have function with three variables assume this is a function with three variables a b and c the combination can be can be 0 0 0 0 0 1 0 1 0 0 1 1 1 0 0 1 0 1 1 1 0 and 1 1 1 okay and now he is saying we have exactly three min terms we have exactly three min terms exactly three min terms that means in a function we have exactly three ones those ones can be anywhere they, they those ones can be here also right those ones can be like this also right we have three min terms and uh, these ones can be placed anywhere in any co any combination in those eight locations right for for this question we can clearly see this question is of choices that means if we have eight locations and you want to make three locations as one then how many uh, such different co uh, such different positions can be available or how many such different combinations can be available so this question can also be written like this for this if we have total eight choices for three variable function we have total eight choices out of these eight choices we want to make three choices as well so it is eight three c three that is eight c three combinations are possible for these ones right so if you write in it, this particular question in terms of variables you can see if we say if we have n variables if we have n variables and there are exactly there are exactly k min terms there are exactly k min terms then how many such functions are possible then how many such functions are possible okay so the answer to that question will be 2 raised to power n combinations for those variables c k 2 raised to power n c k that means uh, for these n variables there are 2 raised to power n different combinations are possible for example for these three variables 2 raised to power 3 n that means eight different functions are possible out of these eight different functions we have to make three functions as one and all the location should be zero so if you write exactly that means 2 s power n c k but if the question is instead of exactly we say we have at most at most or we can also have at least 
we can also have at least what is what do you mean by at most the question is if we have n variables and there are at most k min terms in the function at most that means uh, max to max there are k min terms so min terms can be 0 min terms can be 1 min terms can be 2 but at maximum there will be k min terms right so uh, in that case how many functions are possible there will be 2 raised to power n c0 plus 2 raised to power n c1 plus 2 raised to power n c2 plus up to so on 2 raised to power n c k 2 raised to power n c k and when the question is about at least when the question is at least that means there are at least k min terms then it will be how many functions are possible 2 raised to power n c k plus 2 raised to power n c k plus 1 plus 2 raised to power n c k plus 2 plus up to so on 2 raised to power n c n 2 raised to power n c 2 raised to power n 2 raised to power n c 2 raised to power n okay so this is for at least this is for at most and this is for uh, n variables okay so you can answer this question like this i hope this is visible if it is not visible then i can uh, write it upwards but